Hi there and welcome to today's Quentin Carpenter Nature of Flowers Photoshop video. Today I'm going to show you how to make those really amazing glowing effects. As you can see in front of us here we've got a picture of a flower, which is a regular flower here, and we've made it glow so it looks like it is shining and radiating light. Okay, we'll have a go from start to finish. I'll show you how to do this and you can make text like this or you can make objects or even people. Okay, to do this we're going to need a blank background. So we're going to pop over here, we've got a nice blank wall. And what we're going to do then is we're going to place a picture of a flower. So we're going to go to File, Place Embedded, Find Our Flower, and click Place. And once we're happy with it, press Enter, and then we need to rasterize it by right clicking and clicking Rasterize Layer. Once we've done that, we're ready to do the glowing effect. First thing we need to do is make the actual flower itself look like it's glowing. So we're going to go to Image, Adjustments, hue and saturation and we're going to give it some more saturation so there's more color being added and we're going to make it slightly darker here so you can see the definition of it and once we're happy with that we're going to click ok and we can see our glowing effect of the flower now we're going to add some effects to the background so it looks like the light is bleeding out of it onto the background so to do this, we are going to right click on where the layer is, where the writing is, and go to blending options. The first thing we're going to do is create a bevel and emboss, and we're going to make sure we click on it so it goes light gray. We're going to do an inner bevel here. We're going to make sure it is rendered smooth, and we're going to make sure it's quite soft along this bar here, and we'll check the size here so that we've got the right size. Once we're happy with this, we will click OK and you'll see that we've now got sort of a darker edge here and a lighter edge here. Next we need to add some of the glowing effect. To do that we're going to use a drop shadow. So if we right click on here again, go back to blending options and at the bottom of the menu you'll see we've got a drop shadow. So if we tick this and click on it, we can choose whatever color we want our drop shadow to be and we can change the colors here and here I'm going to go for something quite similar looking and once we've got that we're going to make it about 50% opaque so that you can see the background for it we are going to make sure it's quite big so it glows outwards and I'm going to change the spread so it spreads more or less we can adjust these and you can see that if I move this bar, you can see it changing in real time. So as we make changes here, we can see what's going on over there. Once we're happy with that, I'm just take that down a little bit so that it glows out evenly. We're going to click OK. Now we could leave it with one drop shadow, but to make it more glowy, we're going to add another drop shadow with a lighter colour. So we're going to go to blending options. And you can see down here, I can add a new drop shadow here. And I click on that one, and I can make this one a lighter color. I click OK. Now, if I, I'm clever with my adjustments here, make the slice bigger or smaller, and the spread bigger and smaller, you can see how it affects the image, and it really makes it pop. So once I've got those parts where I want them, Click OK, and now I've got my really cool glowing flower, which is awesome. OK, once done that, obviously save it, and we can use it in one of our projects. So we're going to call it Glow Effect 2. Now, I hope you've enjoyed watching how to make a glowing effect of a flower. If you have, obviously pop over to the channel. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and tick the notification bell to enjoy my latest videos. Okay, thanks for watching and have a really happy Christmas as we are recording this just before Christmas, hence the glowy effect. Okay, thank you and goodbye.